Hello, everybody, and welcome to our third official Amazon Live for Bark and Slumber Premium Pet Beds. Before we get started, we're going to do some quick introductions. My name's Rachel. Hi, my name is Elaine. And then this is our very special guest today. This is Moo Moo Pie. Hey, Moo Moo Pie. Yes, we're so excited to have both of you here. Yeah. And Moo Moo is actually one of our Bark and Slumber models. Mm -hmm. So you might recognize her from some of our product photos and videos on our website and on Amazon. Um, and then Elaine and Moo Moo are actually brand ambassadors for Bark and yeah. Slumber as well. It's a really luxury, nice brand. So my person Moo Moo's very well. So we're really happy to support it. Yes, we're so yeah. happy to have you both on our ambassador team to help spread the word about Bark and Slumber and thank you mm -hmm. so much for being here today. So I'm gonna go ahead and just do some quick shout outs. We typically do these and give everybody about 30 seconds to hop on and join mm. us today. Okay. So I always do my two classic shout outs to my mm -hmm. husband and my dog. So hi Austin and Winnie watching at home. And then I'm gonna switch it up a little bit today and do a shout out to my good friend Cheyenne. We just got married. So hi to Cheyenne and her husband John. Mm -hmm. Yep. Congratulations to Cheyenne as well. Mm -hmm. uh, well, I would like to do a shout out to my husband as well because he's a big support to Mumu. He always makes sure Mumu is well taken care of and he drives the Mumu's everywhere, making sure she's going to all her appointments and things like that. But I also want to do a special shout out to one of Mumu's friend, um, Daisy and Pixie, who's also a uh, Bark and Slumber model as well and their owner, Regis. And Pixie and Daisy are also Mumu dance partner. You know, we go to different events and different things together all the time. And they also are very much enjoying join their Bark and Slumber bed. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Shout out to all three of you. We love all of our Bark and Slumber models. We have a super talented team of dog models mm -hmm. out there. So yes, yeah. shout out to all of you. So we've given everybody about 30 seconds to hop on and Mumu is making herself comfortable. <laughs> we yep, love to see she it. Is. So before we get started with today's official topic, I do just want to do a quick brand summary, maybe for our viewers are out there that aren't as familiar with Bark and Slumber. So if you want a really in-depth summary of Bark and Slumber, the brand, we did during our first Amazon Live a brand introduction. So if you're interested in specifics about the brand and what makes it so special, I would highly recommend going to watch that Amazon Live. Um, but today we are actually going to be focusing on the launch of Bark and Slumber covers, which is super exciting. Ooh, very exciting. So now all of our beautiful Bark and Slumber covers are sold separately on Amazon. Uh, previously, we were only selling the complete pet bed, mm -hmm. like the one that you saw, yep, that you see Moomoo in here today. Mm -hmm. um, and you actually bought a complete bed. Yeah, the Bark whole, and Slumber this whole bed. thing. Yep. Exactly. So we really wanted to offer additional flexibility in the different options that you have. Mm -hmm. So now our covers are sold separately and we're super excited about that. So before we get started and start talking about the details of covers and maybe why you would buy a cover as opposed to purchasing an entire pet bed, I'm going to do a couple quick reminders. So a reminder that you can uh, shop any of the covers, beds, anything we're talking about today directly below. So nice and convenient if you see something that you like. Like. And then as always, ask us any questions. We're gonna be responding to questions directly in the chat below. So don't hesitate to reach out if you have something that you want answered. Yes. Perfect, you ready to get started? Oh yes, absolutely. Moomoo, are you I'm ready to so get sure started? I'm not so sure Moomoo is ready to get started because she's sleeping. Nope, she's doing exactly <laughs> what she's supposed to. Yeah. Good job, Moomoo. Okay, so let's talk about, actually Moomoo's bed. So yes. this is our Toby Triangle sofa bed. Mm -hmm. um, and you purchased this for Moomoo a couple months ago. Yes. So how did you decide on this particular Bark and Slumber bed for Moomoo? Well, first of all, I wanted to pick something that she's already used to. So mm -hmm. from, you know, something that she's familiar in terms of the structures of the bed. And currently the one that she had at home is much smaller, much thinner, mm -hmm. but it has that, um, the, kind of the arm, yeah, yeah the arm rest, um, which you can put her head on. And um, it's also like had a little bit of thick uh, cushion underneath it. So I wanted to go with, I know this kind of shapes and types and size. But then uh, when I was at the photo shoot, during the photo shoot, I was really trying to pay attention um, to observe Mumu's behavior to see what she might like if, if she have a, you know, a change of a bed or something like that. And one mm -hmm. thing that really, really caught the attention was that she really seems to enjoy the furry, um, Faux Sherpa, yeah, yeah. the fuzzy stuff. Because every time when she had the photo time, um, she will get right on it. And then she just lays right flat on. And even if when the camera guy wants him to try to sit up and look like all perky, yep. she's like, no, I don't want to. I want to lay down and just all tuck her, tuck, tuck her out and be Take comfy. A snooze, yeah. And I, I knew that the um, the shepherd lining really has kind of like a calming effect to make her feel really warm and cozy. Mm -hmm. So somewhere down the line, I know when I was picking the bed, I want to pick one with the cover that has the shepherd lining in it, uh, no matter what. But then when um, when it was up to me to pick up, obviously I want to pick something that mm -hmm. makes Mumu look cute and 
look pretty and look good. So I was going with all the picture, and at the beginning, I was really thinking the pinkish one because it makes her, you know, brings her color out really nicely. Sorry, I have a bed <laughs> hidden in the <laughs> yeah. corner. We'll talk about that you know, later, but Mumu is Mumu's kind of excited to go look at that yeah. one as well. But um, Mumu, you want to come sit back in your bed? When I was trying to pick the bed, I also wanted to ask my husband for his opinion as well, since he's a big support and all. So I was going through the picture, and I asked him to pick one bed, and he wanted to actually go with something that complements the decor in our home. Yeah. And we have a black couch, we have, you know, speaker in the living room and I wanted to add this extra bed in the living room for Mumu to sleep on. So I was looking at around the uh, color of the house and my husband said pick something black which goes well and goes easy with whatever uh, furniture that I have and I found out that you know this one complements it really really nicely. Yeah that mm -hmm. beautiful Toby triangles print I mean yeah. like you said it's a great neutral color yeah. that pattern is so fun so it really works with a blend of different mm -hmm. home decor styles so it's great to hear that it's working well in your home. Yeah and then when I was also going through some pictures I realized that this is actually the very first picture that we took for Brock and Slumber. That was the the bad yeah, style yeah. that Mumu laid on, I remember very clearly. So I thought that was meant to be. It was an easy pick from the start. It yeah. was. Mumu clearly loves this pattern. Yeah. So I'm hey, so Mumu, glad. Mumu, you, you want to join us? Come on. <laughs> yeah. Hi Mu, come on. Yay. There, there we go. go. You're not stuck. Come on. Good girl. Back to bed. Rough Yay. life. <laughs> <laughs> and thank you so much for bringing up that beautiful faux Sherpa yeah. sleep surface she on She really, there. really enjoys it. And I know that mm -hmm. she digs on it all the time. And I, it's a natural dog behavior for them to, when they feel really comfy, really want to like kind of calm themselves at night, she does it. Mm -hmm. And I'm really impressed by how well it holds up with all from all the digging. She digs every night before she goes to sleep. And this still, still is really, really nice and um, sweet for her. Absolutely. That's a great point, too, because I do want to call out that all of the fabrics we featured are actually have a backing on them. Oh, wow. So them all having that backing makes them really durable. So mm -hmm. it is great for dogs that do like to dig and mm -hmm. scratch. So we want to make sure that your bed holds up to whatever your dog's going to put mm -hmm. it through. So Sweet. just a great call out about that. So one reason that you might think that you want to buy a different cover is actually a great point bringing up that faux Sherpa. So we do have different fabrics on different beds. So that faux Sherpa is a great option for colder months. Mm -hmm. Obviously with it having the first day of fall, yeah. we're- Makes her feel warm for exactly. right now. Exactly, we're yeah. fo fully invested in fall now, winter's coming up. Mm -hmm. You want something that's gonna be like you said, warm and cozy for your dog to cuddle up in when it's cold outside. So a great option for colder months. However, say you've bought a bed that has faux Sherpa and come spring or summertime, temperatures mm. are warming up a little bit and you might want an option that's a little bit cooler for your dog you could buy a cover and make yep. that happen. So this is actually one of our lounger styles, but let's look at this one really quick. And this Ooh. is our good boy, or we'll call it today, good girl gray. Good girl gray. Yes, mm -hmm. we have to do that for Moo Moo. <laughs> um, but this one features a little bit different fabric sleep surface than that faux Sherpa. So this one is gonna be our faux suede. And if you touch that right mm -hmm. there, so soft, yep. like it's almost buttery. Buttery soft, very nice. Mm -hmm. yeah. But it also has a little bit of texture to it still. Absolutely. And nice and thick, almost like cushioning. Yeah, yeah very nice. so this is a great option for those warmer months. Um, great for dogs that run a little bit warmer as well. But when temperatures start to heat up, you're definitely gonna wanna switch your cover to something a little bit more like this. And you brought up that beautiful, intricate detailing on that. This I wanna call out is really cool. So you have that gorgeous quilting pattern that definitely adds like a luxurious, mm. premium kind of feel to the bed. I don't bed. think I see this any in other beds. Exactly. Yeah, it's the first time I've ever seen it. And the nice. coolest thing that I learned about this the other day is that the quilting is actually done with a technique that doesn't involve any threads wow. at all. There's no stitching. Exactly. So yeah. we wow. really put a lot of thought and mm -hmm. like design and product development into these to make sure that they're practical. So not having those threads ensures that your dog's nails don't Especially snag if there are them. diggers like Mumu, yep, then you don't, they don't get their nails um, stuck between the stitches and pull it out. Exactly. Yeah. Yes. So that faux suede is definitely going to be a great option, like yep. we said, for warmer temperatures. So that's one reason why you might want to swap out your covers. Mm -hmm. Another great reason that you might want to decide to buy a cover as opposed to a whole new pet bed, maybe you already own a Bark and Slumber bed or mm -hmm. a competitor's bed, and you've just recently updated your home decor. So I'm the type of person that I'm never satisfied with my home. <laughs> I'm literally always changing things. So if you've maybe updated a room and the bed that you previously bought just isn't working with the aesthetic anymore. Now you can easily buy a new cover and you don't have to replace your entire bed yeah. and find something that fits a little better 
better with that new decor style. Very so convenient. It is super yeah. convenient. So that's a great option, like I said, for people like me that are just constantly updating things in your house. Also, if you have different aesthetics in different rooms, mm -hmm. that's a great option. So you can buy covers and kind of make it like you have two different pet beds. So yeah. really good flexibility in a lot of different things. So we do have so many different options to choose from, and we'll get into each of those a little more specifically later. Mm -hmm. But we do have 10 different patterns and colors wow. to choose from, so lots of lots of options It was there. hard for us to choose because there were so many nice ones. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. So we do have two different collections. We have more modern styles mm -hmm. as well as more traditional styles, so we'll go through those in a bit. But I would love to play a quick video clip that sure. shows kind of the whole collection and everything we have to offer. So let's roll that really quickly. Okay, so you can see there from that video clip, we do offer quite the array of different patterns and colors to choose from. So I'd love to jump in and talk a little more in depth about all those different options. Mm -hmm. So let's start by talking about, you may have heard us say it a couple times, we offer both woven and patterned fabrics and you look so cozy. <laughs> wow. That's one of also another feature she likes this. Loves to this lay her head on that bolster. Yeah. Yep. So Good I can girl. lay my head on it if I want to. <laughs> Take a little nap while we yeah. talk about covers. Sweet. So our woven and our patterned options. So in our woven options, these are gonna be very tightly woven fabrics, which is amazing. They almost feel like upholstery grade, so it's very similar to like furniture grade mm. fabric. So these are a great luxurious option, and the weave on these is gonna be very tight, which is perfect because you may have experienced like snagging on woven materials with dog claws in the past, but these are so tightly woven that that's not an issue. So definitely great when it comes to durability like we talked about, and they have that backing on them as well that we mm -hmm. mentioned earlier. So very durable fabrics. These are gonna be great options for those of you that like solid colors. So we offer four different beautiful solid covers to choose from with our wovens. And I love the woven texture. It almost makes it look kind of like a heathering detail. Mm -hmm. So again, adding that premium element to everything. It's really nice and thick. You can feel the durability when you touch it. Exactly, yeah. like a substantial. And, but it still gives yeah. it like a, almost like an organic kind of uh, feel to it. Yeah, yeah I love the feeling nice. of these yeah. ones and the texture on those. Yeah. So our first woven option, we talked about it a little bit, but is Good Boy, or as we're calling it today, Good, <laughs> good Girl, Girl Gray, because Moo Moo is here today. <laughs> so a beautiful kind of slate gray option, which is great for those of you that love neutrals. Yeah. And we talked about that beautiful faux suede sleep surface with the quilted pattern on there. So definitely love that option. Option. Let's go ahead and talk about our second. This is our Bella Blue Woven. Mm. So Coastal Grandmother is back in a major way. I love that aesthetic. I decorate my home like I'm a Coastal Grandmother. So that, I feel like resurgence of that aesthetic has really brought blue back in a major way. So I'm loving all the blue we're seeing out there. And this is just a beautiful, rich blue. Um, same beautiful quilted detailing on that. And I really think blue is almost like a new neutral. So it's a neutral, but you can still add like a fun pop of color to your home. Are you hiding? <laughs> <laughs> it also gives it a nice little denim feel to it when exactly. you see the edge of it. And mm -hmm. I know some people are definitely big denim fans, so that will go well with that kind of style as well. Exactly, yeah. yes. But it's a very nice shade of blue. Definitely a nice shade yeah. of blue. Then we're moving into our Bentley Brown Woven. So we talked a little bit more in depth about this in our last Amazon Live segment, but this is a really great option for those of you out there that may have mid-century modern decor. Mm -hmm. So it's a nice warm brown that definitely works well with like wood tones in people's houses. <laughs> so a great option if you have, like I said, if you're an MCM lover, a great option for that. And one thing that I do wanna call out about all of our, hello, round <laughs> lounger and lounger styles is that they're reversible. So you have that beautiful woven Bentley Brown fabric on the front, but you can flip it over and it features that gorgeous kind of cooling faux suede yeah. that we've been talking about, it's nice very, and soft. very, very soft. I mean, mm -hmm. it's soft, but you really can feel the thickness to it. Mm -hmm. I mean, you definitely can feel quality for sure. Absolutely. Yeah. And it almost gives you two beds in one, which I yeah. love that, the reversibility. You can choose if you want the woven fabric to be your pet sleep surface. You look so cozy. She is sleeping. <laughs> or you, you can hear her snoring. Yeah, she's snoring. 
drawing yard. Mike's might pick that up a little bit, but Mumu's having a great oh time goodness. here with her bark and slumber bed. <laughs> or you have this lovely faux suede on the back, and this is in like a linen kind of cream <laughs> color. So just two different options. If you you know wanted something a little bit more neutral, flip mm -hmm. it over to the side, and you have a completely different look. It's also nice that if you were lazy to clean, like me, if you have all the dog hair filled on one side mm -hmm. and you don't want to lint roll, you don't want to vacuum, and you have a gas coming over, all of a sudden you can just flop, turn it over onto the other side and you have a nice clean bed with dual sleeping surface. Absolutely. <laughs> Anytime I can get out of doing laundry <laughs> yeah. or lint rolling things, I'm all about that. So we love the reversibility. And then rounding out all of our beautiful woven options is gonna be our Luna Linen Cream. So definitely a very like classic, neutral color. Mm -hmm. I love this. Neutral decor is back and here to stay. So that this will is go just, well with everything. Exactly, yeah. feels very crisp and clean. Mm -hmm. And then we talked about the faux suede, kind of that rich cognac. I love the contrast of that on that, just some beautiful detailing. And again, you have the reversibility. So you have that beautiful linen cream option on the front. If you want something a little richer, you can swap it and have this be your sleep surface. And now you have that beautiful cognac color in your, in your home decor. And one other color I wanna make about all of our beds is this handle that you see mm. right here. So it's kind of our signature, um, but the handle is not only kind of a stylistic detail, but it's also functional. And I think you yes. use your handle, right? Oh yeah, absolutely. I mean, at the beginning I didn't pick up you know what it was but when mm -hmm. I opened the bed and I saw it I'm like wait this is not a tag it's mm -hmm. actually a function yeah and I grabbed a hold of it, I'm like there's a handle on the bed I was mm -hmm. so excited because all the bed that we owned before not one has a handle built in and honestly when you're cleaning the bed or you're moving the bed you want to just lift it up and vacuum the carpet underneath whatever it makes it so convenient and so beneficial what a thoughtful feature absolutely very, very nice. i'll give a shout out to our product development yeah. design team for for coming yeah. up with that especially when you see some of the giant size mattresses this big i mean obviously the dog may not help you move it yeah you gotta move it the handle comes in very handy yeah you can see our xl bed on the bottom yeah. over there having that handle is definitely a benefit Benefit. So we really tried to marry like functionality and style when we were coming up with this brand. Yeah. So it looks good on the bed, but it's also a very good feature. Absolutely. Yeah. So those are all of our woven options. Let's shift gears and talk about super exciting all of our patterns. So another plug for our last Amazon Live, um, we talked specifically about design and development of all the patterns. We have an extremely talented design team in-house in Michigan that does all of our trend research. They go to Europe. They're definitely <laughs> very good at what they do. Um, and they're working three years ahead. So right now wow. they're looking at patterns for 2025, which is crazy, but amazing. Wow. So they've put a lot of thought into coming up with the best patterns that are gonna blend seamlessly with your home decor mm -hmm. and really make them feel premium. Mm. So let's talk about those. So this is actually our best seller. This is the Henry Houndstooth and our merchandising team did a fantastic job <laughs> coming up with the names. They put a lot of thought into those, so good job to them. But our Henry Houndstooth. So I love the Houndstooth print. It's one of the ones in our traditional collection, but I feel like this is done in a very, very neutral way, like we said, so you can blend it seamlessly with several different decor styles. So a great option for that. I also think that that will make any dog breed looks beautiful. On Absolutely, it. yeah. Any dog's gonna look great on this one. Exactly. And then and it's good for the dog hair because it mm -hmm. won't show up as much because the color is so like almost like unified with a lot of the breed out there. So it's good to pick something that the dog hair doesn't show up. Exactly. Yeah. That's actually a tip I saw when buying couches is that you're supposed to buy like a dog bed that ma or kind of a blends, couch that blends matches into yeah. the dog hair. Exactly. Yeah. So, so you don't see the dog hair. Exactly. Yeah. So that's a good shout. If you have a lot, uh, light colored yeah. dog, that's what that's that's why that one is popular. Yep. <laughs> exactly. So then we're going to move into our rust medallion print. This is our roll over rust. This is a beautiful, again, traditional option in our traditional collection. Um, beautiful color. And I love that kind of intricate pattern, but it's also done in a way that almost looks distressed, which I love. So a little just, bit of antique feel to it. Exactly. Just like a fun twist on yeah. that. Mobile well, actually looks really pretty on that one. That was my pick. Yeah. But the husband one. <laughs> okay. Well, now that the covers are sold separately. That's true. Now have... I can fight it. But like, hey, can we please switch it just so that Mumu can look good on it? <laughs> exactly. Another cover option for yeah. Mumu. 
Moving into our Ollie Green Herringbone. This is my favorite out of all of them. I love this for a, a number of different reasons. I'm a sucker for herringbone, but I also love green. Mm. And we've seen that green is really back in a major way and here to stay. Mm -hmm. So I feel like it all kind of, when Sherwin-Williams launched their color of the year with that evergreen fog, everyone ran out and started painting their house green, me included. It's refreshing. It is. Yeah. It's also energizing, which is nice. Exactly. Yeah. You and I were chatting earlier and green just kind of brings like a sense of calm mm. to your space. And we've seen a huge trend with people trying to bring natural elements from kind of outdoors and mm -hmm. in, put that in their home decor. Yeah. So green is a great way to do that. Um, so a great option if you want to add a pop of color and like you said, just kind of make your space calm. And it's a very like, comfy shade of green. Exactly. <laughs> so a great option. Enough said about this one. Yay. This is a great option that <laughs> Moo Moo loves. This is our Toby Triangles print. So this is part of our modern collection. Again, a great neutral. Black's gonna work with a lot of different home decor styles. That triangle print is so fun, and it has that beautiful contrasting faux suede. That cognac. really makes it pop. It does, I love that option. I couldn't have designed it any better, but I didn't design it. <laughs> <laughs> And then our last option is going to be our Bailey Blue Geo. So another option from our modern collection, you can see that modern Geo print throughout. And again, blue here in a major way, a great option to add a little bit more color and like a fun design to your home decor. Mm -hmm. So those are all of our different cover options. And again, I do wanna call out that they are all designed in-house in Michigan wow. after a lot of careful trend research. Hey. So we presented all of our different cover options to everyone out there watching. So I would love to show everybody, once you've bought a cover, how easy it can be hmm. to swap out That's your cover on your mm -hmm. Bark and Slumber bed. Sure. So quickly, we're actually gonna watch an assembly video that our very talented studio team put together that shows you in-depth kind of walkthrough of how you put that together. And then hmm. when we come back after watching that, Elaine and I are gonna put a sofa bed together. All right. So let's go ahead and roll that clip. How to bring your Bark and Slumber pet bed to life. Bark and Slumber pet beds arrive compressed to help cut down on shipping waste. First, carefully open the insert by making a small cut at the end of the plastic and using your hands to pull the remaining plastic open. You should have one base insert and two sofa bolster inserts. Next, unzip the bottom compartment and slide the base insert in. Then zip closed. Slide one bolster into one side of the top compartment. The zipper on the elbow of the bolster should face the back corner of the side you are filling. Fill the remainder of the compartment with the second bolster, then zip closed. Massage to the proper shape, snuggle up, and enjoy. Congratulate your assembly partner on a job well done. Okay, you can see from that clip mm. how quickly and easily these come together. Oh, so yes. very easy to swap your cover. So we're actually gonna do it right now, Elaine and I. Mm -hmm. So we have Mumu's favorite Toby Triangles bed and we're gonna take that cover off and put on this beautiful good girl gray cover mm -hmm. that we were talking about earlier. Mm -hmm. So one thing I wanna call out while Elaine is doing this is we have this strong wraparound zipper on all of our beds. So these zippers are extremely durable so you don't have to worry about them breaking. When we were on our recent photo shoot that Mumu was a part of, I think I unzipped and rezipped these beds like 300 times and they okay. held up really well. Really so. through the quality on the zipper. Exactly. Too. So we're going to pull out our base insert and our two bolsters yeah, and I'm going to set our old cover over here now that we're it. done with it. Yeah. So let's grab our new Good Girl Grey cover. So the first thing we're going to want to do is slide that base insert into the biggest compartment. So Aline, if you can, perfect. And we're going to match up those corners. And then another call out I want to make about actually this insert itself is that all of our inserts are going to be water repellent, which is amazing. If you're potty training a dog, oh, let oh, me grab a oh, perfect thing. Thank you. Yep. And you want to hand me one of those bolsters. Mm -hmm. If you're potty training a dog or you have a dog that may have like incontinence issues, the water repellents on those inserts is going to be great, a great option for that to make sure that the fill is nice and protected. So when you're putting together this bed, you're gonna to want to put your first bolster and slide it all the way down into this compartment here. And you want to start on the side where the zipper actually starts. So place your first bolster. 
We're gonna zip this to the middle over here. And then Elaine has put our second bolster in. So you're gonna kind of want to work as you go. We tuck that in. Yep. And then we're done. And speaking about the the water repellent, it's really, really a beneficial feature, number one, because in the past we bought a lot of pet beds that they say, oh, you can wash it, you know, it's water repellent, but turns out many of them on the market wasn't really holding up. And we, we have owned so many pet beds between the three dogs that we had before. Mm -hmm. um, we wash it and then we throw them in the wash. It comes out, they're already destroyed. The inside was all bundled up. And this one, you can basically just wash the cover itself, but the inside is also protected. So it gives you like, almost like two layers of protection for, you know, if the dog do soil or pee or poop on it or throw up on it, it makes it really convenient and you can really feel the quality and the luxuriness to it. Um, and it's also nice to know that you can just toss this into wash, which is makes it, um, you know, really, really convenient and sustainable because only just one bet can last many, many years down the road. Absolutely. Yep. Hey, Momo, try it out. Momo, you want to try out your bed? New bed, yay. Yes, thank Good you job. for bringing that up, Elaine. Yeah. That's a great point is that the covers are all going to be machine washable. So that was something we had pretty much every pet parent asking for when we were coming up with this brand. Washability is such a huge thing that a lot of people want in their pet mm -hmm. beds. So like you said, we've showed how easy it is to take off your cover. Great for potty training, great for dogs with incontinence, you know, or if your dog just got their, their bed muddy, you have mm -hmm. company coming over that you mentioned true. earlier, just throw it in the wash, machine wash cold, tumble dry low, good yeah, as Many, new. many bed, pet beds really in the market that we have bought in the past cannot be washed. You wash mm -hmm. it, they're destroyed. This one, you can wash the cover, you can wash the inside, everything's great. Mm -hmm. Yep, very Absolutely. nice. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. So then let's talk about one other reason that you may want to swap out your cover. So maybe you've bought a competitor's bed. Boo. <laughs> we forgive you though. So you've bought a competitor's bed and maybe you're bored with it. We, like we talked about, a lot of the pet mm -hmm. beds that are already on the market are kind of very bland. Mm -hmm. The type of dog bed that's an eyesore, doesn't match with your decor and you kind of want to hide it when company comes mm -hmm. over. Or is you already old, you have a bed that's already worn down, you know, the fabric's already getting dirty and old. You exactly. Want a new fresh look. You it. want something fresh, yep. you want that premium pet bed, but you don't want to have to buy an entire new bed. The covers are a great option because you can easily just buy a cover for your existing bed and mm. kind of elevate what you already have. So I'm gonna grab this cover right here. Oops, sorry, not that one. Let's grab, let's grab this guy right here. So I'm gonna unzip this. Yeah, you can just set that oh, next yep. to you. I'm gonna unzip this and we have, you know, like I said, maybe your boring existing pet bed here. So we are gonna place this one right in there. We're gonna line up our corners like we just talked about. And then that zipper is over here. So we're just gonna zip this guy closed. Perfect, thank you, Elaine. I'm gonna tuck that. And you're done. Mm -hmm. So you can see that we took boring beige bland pet bed with the Yay. addition of just a cover, and now you have an elevated luxury pet bed that Very looks nice. great in your home. So that was Give nice us and a easy. nice, new, refreshed look. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. And I love that this is kind of a sustainable option, right? Yes. We've talked about in some of our previous Amazon Lives that our inserts ship compressed in order to cut down on shipping waste. So at Bark and Slumber, we really are trying to do our part when it comes to sustainability. So offering covers sold separately is a great way to do that, right? You're only replacing definitely. what you need. So yep, definitely. Yes, trying to help out the environment there. And sometimes I think some dog, like I was saying, they get used to a certain mm -hmm. uh, material. So their old bed maybe is really what that dog is already used to. And you don't really want to change that comfort level, even mm -hmm. though, you know, sometimes you might want to give them a little bit more support as they age, mm -hmm. right? But now, you know, you can keep the inside and just throw the new look and new covers when you move or, you know, just maybe when you're just traveling, you know what, you want to keep it, you know, different places when they, you know, uh, go into some place, you're going to be camping. Mm -hmm. You can have this and prevent the dirt and then throw it in the wash and come back and, you know, swap another one when you get home. So Absolutely. Really nice. Or holiday time, you can decorate it with whatever season that you're Right? Having. Yep. So this is a great option, nice. great option for Halloween. So yes. if you have your spooky mm -hmm. decor out, the Toby That's triangles. That's going to be a popular Halloween pattern. Absolutely, <laughs> yeah, I can see the little flag, like, little you know triangle, and mm -hmm. the white. Mm -hmm. I can definitely see that. Yeah. 
Well, awesome. Thank you so much for joining today yes. and talking about the magic of covers sold separately. So I want to thank you and Mumu for being here. And then I also want to thank everyone out there that joined our live stream today. We really appreciate you taking time out of your day to come sit and chat with us. So a couple more reminders that our next live stream is going to be the week of October 22nd. And that's a very special spooky Halloween episode. So come join us and we're going to have mm. some fun on that one. And like we said before, a reminder that all the products, all the covers we featured here today are gonna to be available for purchase below. So very convenient if you saw something you like. And if you have any questions, obviously we've had you drop them in the chat up until now, uh, mm -hmm. but now that our segment's coming to an end, if you have any additional questions, reach out to us at hello at Bark and Slumber and we would love to chat more with you. But that is gonna do it for us. So mm -hmm. thank you, Elaine, and thank you, Mumu. And let's go ahead and watch one last video. And that's gonna be it for today. All thank right. you. Thank you.